Good morning, YouTube. Welcome to another episode of Frank's Garage, or what the hell did I get myself into this time? Uh, doing inner axle seals on a 2012 Ram 2500. Uh, evidently, we have to pull both axle shafts in order to get the carrier out to access the seals. We need to do this without damaging the wheel hubs. Uh, I watched one video the other day, and the guy was changing a U-joint, and he blew apart the hub. So, I needed to come up with a better way. This is an inner tie rod from I don't know what. I don't remember, but I'm a bit of a pack rat, so I save these things. I cut it off. I've got myself a little swinging press tool. Thread it in so it's got full thread coverage. This is M14. I don't know what the pitch is. I didn't care to measure at the time. I just know it fits. There. The other side came apart fairly easy. I'm hoping this one will come apart the same way. Uh, a few swings with the Oh Jesus hammer and uh, we'll get on with it. Please put up with the noise. I don't know if you can see in the video. We'll sling in a little closer. And there is a gap forming at the bottom corner. So I'll move up to the top. I'll give it a couple whacks. I'll turn it and hit the other side. Slide you back. In case you're wondering, you're attached to my oil drain. Not as hard as you'd think. Uh, quite soft, surprisingly. Okay, right there, a couple more wax. Oh, yeah. That's going. Actually, I just see a little fry in here. Look at that. One here. Ladies and gentlemen, it's free. So is my advice. Now this is a year-round driven vehicle in Canada with salt on the highways. These are all typically seized to some extent or another. So your results may vary. If you've gotten to this point and can't figure out how to get the hub off, I hope this helps you. Have a great day.